We welcome you back to Wolves Live presented by CenturyLink. So pleased to have Brad Ryder, the uh, Timberwolves Vice President of Communications, joining us. And for a reason, the Fox Sports North Timberwolves broadcast auction is coming up next Monday surrounding the uh, Wolves game in Dallas. Let's talk first a little bit because there's some great items. We're going to look at uh, some of them, the list of them as well. But the ultimate destination for all the money raised, the Timberwolves Fast Break Foundation. Yeah, you know, the, the, um, the unfortunate thing about maybe sometimes encore performance is that some of the things that we do in the community may be overshadowed a bit. And people may not realize we're actually out there doing some different things. But, you know, we, we're just as active in the community as we always have been. Uh, we've got a number of different events that we do every year. We just got done with an event at the Mall of America where we took six of our players out there and did a, a Build-A-Bear event with some kids. Um, had an event uh, close to the holidays where we took some kids from the Minnesota Adoption Resource Network to Target and gave them all a $500 gift card. And actually, the players really get into this stuff more than people think that they do. Hard not to. And the Timberwolves throughout their history have been involved with so many great things. So the broadcast auction, unique items. You hear that a lot, but it really is true with this auction, things that you cannot buy anywhere else. Absolutely, you know, we try to come up with items that are not only appealing to fans, but get them thinking, hey, if I don't participate in this, I may never get to, get to do something like this again. And, you know, we're talking about the ultimate fan package here. That's for the Washington game coming up later in, in, in uh, February, where we're offering four courtside seats, a lot of different things in the package, pregame meal, a chance to, to meet the Timberwolves announcers, to go back in the TV truck, see how a production takes place. The road trip for the Timberwolves, it's on the Chicago trip coming up again at the end of February where uh, two people can actually fly on the team charter, stay in the team hotel, get uh, tickets to the game in Chicago. So it's kind of a two night uh, or two day, one night trip to Chicago with the team to rub elbows and sit on the plane with, with the players and stuff. And then the third item is a pizza party and, and a basketball clinic, so to speak, for um, a youth basketball team. And knowing, as I have a son in youth basketball, how these um, seasons are winding down, if, we, if you win this item, you can roll it over into next season, too. So you don't have to try, to try to get it done before the end of this basketball season. They're all great items. The second item, though, if you are a Wolves fan or have a younger Wolves fan, there is nothing better than to really feel like part of the team because you are for that game in Chicago. Participation. How do yes. people get involved with the broadcast auction? If, if people want to go on this weekend and check out a little bit more detail about some of these packages, especially that first one that I kind of skimmed over, you can go to Timberwolves.com. Pre-bidding opens Monday morning at 9 a.m., um, goes to 5 p.m. And then once the uh, once your telecast starts on Monday night here at 7 o'clock, we'll open up the bidding on the phones. We'll have people at Target Center on the phone lines. We're going to do a lot of um, uh, different stories and vignettes and telling our story of the of the Fast Break Foundation, too. We're going to have three or four in-game hits, uh, pre-game and post-game, too, to, to kind of show off a little bit more of the, what the Fast Break Foundation does. It won't be me actually telling the story, either. We'll have people there from these organizations that I've talked about actually helping us tell our story on Monday night. It's a great event. It's Monday night surrounding the Timberwolves game in Dallas with the Mavericks. We hope you will take part in the uh, Timberwolves broadcast auction. Brad Ryder, thanks for uh, dropping by as well, always. We, we always appreciate the time. Thanks, Hanny. All right, you bet.